good evening the topic that we will be discussing in this part is uh, ResNet. Uh, this ResNet is one of the popular uh, CNN architectures and why we have named this ResNet because its full form is residual network residual neural network and the short form is ResNet. Now who created this model uh, it was the Microsoft company that created this model and why they created this model because they wanted to train deep neural network so because of this they created this residual network then is what was the reason behind creating ResNet see in CNN there was a problem the problem was as the depth increases depth increases means as the number of layers increases in CNN then there was a degradation of the model degradation means the accuracy of the network became saturated the more number of layers we are adding the accuracy still remains the same so there is a problem of vanishing gradients and this particular problem is solved by ResNet how this problem is solved by ResNet because they introduced a learning that is called as residual learning what is this learning in residual learning we have blocks which blocks residual blocks what this blocks does is they have skip connections and what is skip connections let us see here in this diagram initially we have an element x that is a data point and it passes through layer subsequent layers maybe layer 1 layer 2 and next part so if layer 1 and layer 2 are insignificant or they are hindering the performance then they can be skipped and when they are skipped then a block is created this skip connections create residual blocks and when we stack all the residual blocks together then we get what is called as ResNet that is a residual network now there are a number of variants of uh, ResNet these are ResNet 18, 34, ResNet 50, ResNet 101, ResNet 152 these numbers that are there at the end 18, 34, 50, 101 and 152 these depicts the number of layers in each variant of ResNet as we enhance the number of layers better is the performance but at the same time computational complexity is also more so this was all about ResNet and the application areas any application areas uh, related to computer vision could be uh, used for ResNet image classification, image segmentation, object detection and many more computer vision applications can be a part of ResNet. So this was all for this video and if you got some knowledge from this video then do like, comment, share and subscribe and thanks for watching.